Hi, hello and welcome to my channel. If you are here, hi, my name is Veronica and I'm a big lover of makeup. So if you want to see more reviews, looks and more fun videos, don't forget to subscribe. Today we are filming a plan to pen video. So if you are curious about that, please keep on watching. I saw Sarah Rose film a video like this one, but she filmed it in December and I was having a pretty defined list of videos that I want to film in December. So I didn't really consider this type of video at that time, but now I want to do a plan to pen for 2023, even though it is a bit late because I already finished uh, one primer and one gloss, but next year or this year at the end of 2023, I will film a plan to pen for 2024 in December. So. I still think we can have a pretty fun video. So let's start talking about the product that I hope I'm gonna finish or at least how many products I hope I'm gonna finish in each category in the next 10, 10-ish months. So let's start with primer and like I mentioned, I already finished the primer. It is a mini, but for my project pen, I am considering minis, um, products, even though they are just smaller sized products, they are not samples or something like that. I don't consider that and I usually don't uh, add that into my project pen, but a mini product it is still pretty a pretty good amount of product. So I already finished one primer and right now I have in the project pen the Essence Hello Good Stuff uh, primer and I think I'm gonna finish that this year and this product. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. It is again a mini product, but I am half done with this one. So I think I will be able to finish this one, the Essence Hello Good Stuff, the Ole Hendrickson one that I already finished. So I am putting a number of three for primers. I believe that it is possible for me to finish another one, but four primers seems a bit much. Three primers are enough for this planning. Then let's move into foundation. For foundation right now, I have the Fenty one in my project pen and the Charlotte Tilbury Glowy Foundation. I think I will be able to finish those two in the next two months, maybe three months. And then I want to finish this one as well. This is the Catrice True Skin Hydrating Foundation. I really love this foundation. It is so, so stunning, so beautiful. So I am uh, putting for this year three foundations into the plan to pen because I think that is possible. The fourth one, similar to the primer, would be just a bit uh, over the line. I think I... I think three is a really good number. Let's move into concealer. I have the Sigma corrector. I am putting the corrector into the concealer category as well. The Sigma corrector, the NYX Bear, Bear With Me or something like that. That's concealer, I have it in the project pen right now as well. And uh, I think I will be able to finish those two and as well the Catrice True Skin uh, concealer, the one in the same line, line with the foundation. In here, I am not that confident because I really enjoy this concealer, but I don't think I am, I am close to be done with it or something like that. So it will be a bit challenging and the NYX, bear with me, it will take maybe another four months or even five, but I'm hopeful. So let's say three concealers. Then for powders, I do have right now the Maybelline Fit Me in the project pen. That one is the pressed powder and I really like using pressed powders for blending the edges of the blush or the bronzer for something like that. I usually set my uh, face with a loose powder. I really enjoy the Huda one, so I'm not gonna put the Huda one into the project pen, but I think I will be able to finish the Maybelline one in like two, three months. And then I think I will put the LYS powder into the project pen and I don't have a pen in it right now but for some reason I think I will be able to finish this one as well. Is that a bit too much? Probably. I want to be realistic with these goals but 
I don't know. I really don't know if I will be able to finish this powder as well, but I am putting two powders into the powder category. And again, I am very hopeful that that could be possible. I really don't know, but I want to challenge myself just a bit and uh, I want to put two powders into this category. Then we have the bronzer and blush category and we will talk about them together. And here I don't have a specific... I do have some products that I want to mention, but I don't have a specific number or something like that. Just because I don't think I want to push myself to use only one bronzer and one blush for the whole year. I would hate that really so I have right now the rare beauty cream bronzer into the project pen I really love that one it is amazing and I put 50 uses on it but I think I will be able to finish it this year maybe I'm gonna put another bronzer in the project pen after these 50 uses and then come back to the rare beauty one I am not really sure but I think I will finish it this year because it is an amazing product. It was in my favorites and it is very creamy. So I think I could be, I could be able to finish it. And then I have the Fenty Cream Blush and that one is almost done really. So for sure I'm gonna finish that one as well. But I think I'm gonna do maybe some progress on other blushes and maybe other bronzers as well, but I don't think I'm gonna finish something else. So only the Fenty Cream Blush and the Rare Beauty uh, Cream Bronzer. And then into the highlighter category, I have right now the Wet n Wild uh, highlighter and I want to finish it up. I really want to finish up a highlighter. I did finish last year the Fenty, no the Fenty, the Becca one. But that one was a mini and this one is just a lot more challenging, but I want to finish it up. I am, I am really liking it. I am wearing it today. It is a beautiful, beautiful highlighter from the drugstore. I really love it. I hate the packaging, but the formula is amazing. So I don't know. I want to finish it up. So I am putting it in the plan to pen to finish it up. But again, if I will not be able to do that, it will be totally fine. It's just an experiment to see what I think I will be able to finish and what things I am learning throughout the year because maybe I am finishing products slower or faster because I didn't expect to finish the Fenty Cream Blush really. I didn't do a close-up in January for that because I was sure that I will do 50 uses and don't see a big progress just because I used it so many times but I don't know I didn't make the connection that using it so many times and using it 50 more times it will probably be done right but um, I was not hopeful in that in that regard but I am finishing it which is amazing I really love that blush so I am very happy and I hope for the highlighter I will I will be done with it until the end of the year and lastly let's talk about glosses because I didn't put any lipsticks or lip liners in this plan to pen just because probably I'm gonna add lipsticks in the bonus monthly item and I don't think I have any <laughs> lipstick that could be done in one month. So I have zero in the category of lipsticks, but in the category of glosses, I put six. Just because I think it is pretty realistic to have one gloss every two months. Even though for some glosses, I could finish them in one month. For example, I finished the... Um, the Fenty Clear Lip Gloss, I finished that in one month. So I could see myself finishing other glosses in one month. But I decided to put six just because the pillow bomb that I have right now in the project pen, I think that one will take maybe two months. And then I put in here the NYX This Is Juice. 
and probably this one will take a bit just because it has how many grams is in here 10 and I think 10 is a pretty good amount yeah this one from elf it has three milliliters so three and this is 10 and <laughs> look at the packaging so it is a pretty good amount of product in here I think I'm gonna finish this one in two months this one I think it is possible for me to finish in one month I really like this formula it is pretty nice and from the drugstore and then I think I will finish the Catrice lip volumizing lip booster that one I think I could finish in one month as well I have that one in a purse somewhere and then I think I will finish another gloss I don't know which one I'm gonna see probably I will buy a new gloss or something like that and I will finish that or maybe actually maybe I'm gonna finish the Sigma lip oil I love that lip oil it is my favorite so maybe I'm gonna finish that and this was everything I am very very excited about this idea I really like just guessing what I will be able to do until the end of the year I think that is a lot of fun so in December probably after the project pen finale I will film an update to this video and see how I did if I guessed correctly and we will do a plan for 2024 as well I don't know if I'm gonna do two different videos or just one I'm gonna decide that in December but I am very happy with this idea and I am very hopeful I really enjoy project painting and yeah so if you like this video and you want to see more from me please subscribe and give it a like and I'll see you next time